get a winning lottery ticket or give a winning lottery ticket. I mean, my parents, they're already millionaires, but a little extra cash never hurt. Excuse me, do you have any money? My parents abandoned me and... I'm sorry, I, I shouldn't have bothered you. Wait! He needs this. I pick this one. Hey, wait up! Dude, wait. What's what's that on the floor over there? Huh? What the heck? What is this? It looks like a lottery ticket. You should probably scratch it, you know, and see if you won anything. You think? Okay. No way. No freaking way! I won! Well, congrats. You should probably go cash that in. I just won a million dollars! <laughs> what was your name? Uh, my name's Jace. I'm Lindsay. It's really nice to meet you. Did you hear about the super attractive guy that transferred here? No. It doesn't matter. Rachel snatched him up anyways. Of course she did. She literally gets all the guys. Surprise! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Jace? Well, congrats. You should probably go cash that in. I just won a million dollars. <laughs> what was your name? Uh, my name's Jace. I'm Lindsay. It's really nice to meet you. Did you hear about the super attractive guy that transferred here? No. It doesn't matter. Rachel snatched him up anyways. Of course she did. She literally gets all the guys. Surprise! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Jace? Huh? Are you his friend? Well, I thought he was my friend. I just met her. Hey, what's this? That's not funny. This is special to me. Let go! Relax! No, dude, let go! Aw, oh, poor baby. Whatever, she's no fun. Who wants to go shopping at Gucci with me? Me, me, I do. What happened to you? What can I say? Money changes people. I need to talk to you. Um, sorry, Jace is busy. Back off, Rachel, this is important. Listen, the only reason that you're rich, Jace, is because of me. <laughs> I'm being serious. You saw something on the floor and told me to look. That's it. I was the one that got the ticket for you and put it for you on the floor. Girl, you need to stop lying, it's embarrassing. It says it above my head. Oh, you want to know what sucks? Only you can see that. You're in love with Jace at minute. I am not. Right, so all this is not you trying to get his attention? Girl, be for real. Yo, Jace. What's up? Looks like Lindsay was telling the truth. Check out this video. Dude, wait. What's, what's that on the floor over there? Huh? So she did throw the lottery ticket on the floor for me? Yeah. Damn it, I gotta go talk to her. Jace, it looks like she needs water. Maybe give her this? Yeah, okay. Hey, I saw the viral video. I'm really sorry. So what you're saying is it took video proof for you to believe me? Nice. Wait, I want to make it up to you. I literally- You're in love with Jace at minute. I am not. Right, so all this is not you trying to get his attention? Girl, be for real. Yo, Jace. What's up? Looks like Lindsay was telling the truth. Check out this video. Dude, wait. What's, what's that on the floor over there? Huh? So she did throw the lottery ticket on the floor for me? Yeah. Damn it, I gotta go talk to her. Jace, it looks like she needs water. Maybe give her this? Yeah, okay. Hey, I saw the viral video. I'm really sorry. So what you're saying is it took video proof for you to believe me? Nice. Wait, I want to make it up to you. I literally owe you big time. I'll buy you anything. I don't know. Don't you want to go hang with Rachel and all her friends? Not really. Uh-huh. Well, I'm gonna go get some water. Hang on. It's funny you say that because I have some right here. Are you sure that this was just water? I mean, yeah, Rachel gave it to me. Rachel? What? Yeah, she just said you looked thirsty. Girly Pop, that's my water. I hope you don't mind it has lemon. Lemon? But I'm allergic to lemon. What? Girly Pop, that's my water. I hope you don't mind it has lemon. Lemon? But I'm allergic to lemon. What? She is not. I've seen her drink lemonade. Rachel, she's obviously having a reaction. Girl, you don't have like an EpiPen or something? <laughs> no, I, I didn't bring mine today. Well, that was dumb. I'm gonna go see if I can find a teacher. Rachel, hurry. It's getting really hard for me to breathe. Where the heck did Rachel go? She's supposed to be getting help. Jeez, I can barely breathe. Okay, we gotta get you help. There's a hospital down the street. Come on. Someone please help. She's having an allergic reaction. Bring her over here. We'll take care of her. This way, hurry. Someone please help. She's having an allergic reaction. Bring her over here. We'll take care of her. This way, hurry. Jace. Lindsay? Oh, thank God you're okay. The doctor said that I'm free to walk around for a little bit. Oh, good. Do you need me to call your parents or anything? No, I've already tried. My parents are both actors and they're on a plane right now to Spain to shoot a movie. Oh, well, whoa. Sorry. It's okay. You should probably go back and sit down. Yeah, probably. Easy now. And I want you to know I'm covering all your medical bills. You didn't have to- It's the least that I can do, Lindsay. Really. Also, I brought this for you. I remember you said it was special to you. Thanks. I also got you a few things, too. 
That was enough, because I could buy more. Yeah, I think I think this is good, thank you. Hey, you made me a millionaire. I literally owe you everything. And I'm sorry. Hey, get back here! <sighs> Officer, wait, see? She's fine. I don't need to go to Juvie. Jace, help me out. Sorry, Rachel. Really hope you learn your lesson. Come on, let's get out of here. Uh, no! Please be more than 50 this time. 100! Oh, no, sweetheart, that says 10. <sighs> what are we gonna do? I don't know, every day she barely gets any brain cells. Hey, don't eat that! I won't have a delinquent for a daughter. Hey, your squishy panda isn't food. You know what? I know what we need to do. You're telling me there's a special smart candy that can boost her brain cells? Yes, but they haven't been tested much. I'm a walrus. Give me those. We're trying them. Open wide, sweetheart. Now chew. Oh my gosh, it's working. Let's test her brain cells. Spell onomatopoeia. Onomatopoeia. O-N-O-M-A-T-O-P-O-E-I-A. Yes, she's smart now. We'll give her the candy every day. <gasps> she actually got a decent amount of brain cells. Guess she doesn't need the candy today. But she's been taking it every day for years. Let me see the candy. She'll be fine. Yeah, there shouldn't be any side effects. Bye, Mom. Bye, Dad. Now, my opponent has pointed out some of the positives of AI, but I would like to point out some of the negatives. Which are, um... Sorry, I can't remember what I was going to say. Yo, is she okay? What the heck is going on? Maybe she got stage fright. You guys, look, she's losing brain cells. Dude, that's not supposed to happen. Hey, girly, are you okay? Maybe we should get you some help. Zapotha. Oh, no. Bro, she's like super dumb now. Today was her big debate. I have to tell her parents. Huh? Come on, you're coming with me. So there was side effects to that smart candy. I guess so. She keeps losing brain cells. I don't know if the candy's gonna work anymore. She's gonna be brain dead without it. Let's just try. Sweetie, open up. Mm -mm. Open up or I'll do it for you. Come on. Good girl. It's kind of working. No, she needs more candy. It's supposed to be one a day. She needs more brain cells. Here, have some more. And a little bit more. Honey, this is a bad idea. She, she has, has infinite, infinite brain, brain cells. cells. Yes. Unfortunately, my intelligence level has now surpassed your small, feeble minds. Honey, she's scaring me. We should take her to get checked out. I think I gave her too much. I wouldn't do that if I were you. Why not? Because my mind is telling me that if you do that, that will be the end of both of you. What? what? Oh, honey. You're up early. Good morning, mother. Good morning, father. We see you still have infinite brain cells. <laughs> When is this smart candy going to wear off? My mind is telling me that the effects from this candy won't be wearing off until around two weeks from now. No, honey, we really need to take you to get checked. I already told you that that is a bad idea. You're not the boss. You may think you know everything, but you don't. I know what you were doing on Instagram last night. Huh? What is she talking about, honey? Uh... Nothing. It's just, um, does the name Sandy Smith ring a bell? How do you know? <gasps> Your ex from high school? Are you still liking her posts? Just two of them. What? So, what I can gather from Dad's body language is that he does love you more than Sandy, but if he doesn't block her within the next two hours, it will lead to a divorce for both of you. Darren? I'm doing it. Uh, she's blocked. <laughs> My sources say that uh, you made the right call. I want her to go back to normal. Same, but as long as she's like this, we might as well make some money off of her. So, how does a game show sound? I would win all the money. Really? Really? But I don't wish to do that at this time. Say what? Why not? <sighs> Reasons you can't understand. <laughs> because you're stupid. That's it. We have to turn her back to normal. Yeah, and I think I know how. Surprise! We got you something. Gummy bears? They're your favorite, right? So go on, have a bite. Did you know that the gummy bear was invented in 1922 in Germany? Wow, thanks for the interesting fact. Now try it. You two are trying to poison me. What? We would never. Well, then you eat it first. Oh, she got me right in the eye. <gasps> oh, honey. That's it. Grab her arms. What? Grab her. No. Sweetie, just hold still. Uh, oh. Ow! Just eat the gummy and this will all be over. Yes, there you go. I thought these gummies were supposed to turn her back to normal. They were. <sighs> She's brain dead. No, honey, please wake up. Oh, no. What the... Oh my gosh, it worked. What just happened? Wow. Uh, I feel really weird. Honey, we're so glad you're back to normal. Back to normal? You're telling me there's a special smart candy that can boost her brain cells? Here, have some more. And a little bit more. Honey, this is a bad idea. 
I remember what you guys did to me. We're so sorry. It won't happen again. Maybe you two should eat some of those smart candies so you could figure out how to do proper parenting. Oh, that's, that's not, not a bad, bad idea. idea. Wait, give me those. You two are banned from these. But... Randomly speak in TikTok sounds or randomly speak in Spanish? My grandparents already do this one all the time, so... Jump scare! <laughs> Ow, Lucy, why would you do that? I don't know, and my options were better than yours. What the? <laughs> what have you done to me? You should really be more careful what option you pick. <laughs> Sex to be you. That's it, come here. Mom! I can't make it to your party. I have to go to Liz's instead. Oh, yeah, totally. We can just plan something another time. Thanks for understanding, girly. Doesn't seem to matter what I do. I'm always number two. What am I doing? Keep backing it up. Yeah, keep going. That's my car you're towing. Well, you're getting a big ticket for parking here. A ticket? Where's my dad? I'm all alone. I'm too small to be here on my own. What the? Miss, are you intoxicated? Babe, I got- Don't you dare use any more of those words, understand? Five million words? That's ridiculous. You won't be using any of those. I'm... What did I tell you about talking? I'm breaking up with you. Oh, really? Where are you gonna go? You don't have any money. Nine million words this year, huh? No one needs that many. Hey, I need you to go to the store for me. I don't like that pink shirt you bought yesterday. I want you to return it. You're allowed to use three words maximum when you go out. Don't be playing games with me this time. I'll be checking your words when you get back. Hi, what would you like to return? Just that? Okay, hold on one second. That'll be six ninety nine back on the card. Please help me. Please help me. Oh, uh, did you need my help finding something in the store, or...? Hey, can we hurry up the line? I'm on my lunch break. I don't got all day. Do you need medical attention? No. Hey, it's okay. Can you wait over there for me, hun, and I'll get someone to help you? You're allowed to use three words maximum when you go out. Don't be playing games with me this time. I'll be checking your words when you get back. I'm so sorry. The line is really busy right now, but my manager will be over here to help you soon. There you are. You took forever. Did you return the shirt? Good. Let's get out of here. Damn, why do I feel like I'm forgetting to do something? Wait a minute. You were supposed to make dinner tonight. Go on. What? Is dinner ready? Hey, 8,996,000? You used an extra word, and you're gonna tell me why. You used an extra word, and you're gonna tell me why. Go on, talk. Explain yourself. It was an accident. I was just telling the cashier thanks. Uh-huh. You sure about that? Yes, I swear. You should really have your dinner. It's getting cold. That's enough talking out of you. Go to sleep. Bed? Now. How did you make that chicken? Why? Because. After I ate it, my head is filling. <sighs> My phone is dead, and his is locked away. I have to get the charger. Please hurry up. <gasps> yes. 911, what's your emergency? I need help. Thank you for the information, ma'am. Officers will arrive shortly. You. You thought you could get away with putting something in my food? Your words. Why did you use up so many? Actually, don't speak. I'll mm. find out. You can't outsmart me. <sighs> So step away from the girl, let's see your hands. Looks like I just did. No. Mommy and Daddy are billionaires, so I know it's going to be a hundred... Five? Honey! Quiet. I just want to know one thing. Why is our rich score so low? Sweetie, I've gone bankrupt. Bankrupt? But Daddy, you're a billionaire. He made a bad investment. I'm sorry, honey. <sighs> well, what are we supposed to do now? Just live like peasants? I can't let anyone know about this. Hi, girly. Oh, hi, girls. Um, what kind of bag is that? Oh, this? It's a designer Gucci bag. Is that a Ross tag? This? I just put that on there so people wouldn't steal it. Why is your score private? It's just so high that I, I don't want to make other people jealous. Please let us see your score. No, you're being sus. My daddy's in charge of these scores, and I'm going to have him make yours public. Mommy, Daddy, we have a huge problem. What? What? Well, you remember my super rich friend Ashley? The one who's friends with Elon Musk? Mm-hmm. Well, her daddy is in charge of these richness score scales, and 
She said she's going to have him make our percentage score public. Oh, boy. What are we going to do? 5% is like peasant material. <sighs> I'm sorry, Pumpkin. I know this is hard. Why are my Gucci shoes in a for sale box? If we sell them, our percentage could go up. Okay, do what you must, because my social status is on the line. Good news, someone bought them on eBay. It only went up 2%. That wasn't worth it. I want my Gucci shoes back. Why did you have to go bankrupt, Daddy? Now tomorrow I'm going to be publicly humiliated. I can't stand to see her like this. The truth is, Daddy didn't actually go bankrupt. You two lied to me? Yes, because we didn't want you to worry. About what? Recently some bad men threatened to take you away from us if we didn't pay them billions. And you listened to them? I had to. Daddy, I would think you would know better. This isn't a joke, Pumpkin. I know these men. They would really come for you. Enough. Have they received the money? The transfer is still pending, but this is why our score is so low. Cancel that transfer. If I do that, they're going to get really upset. Cancel it right now, Daddy, or or I'm going to scream. Okay, all right. It's canceled. We have 100%? I can't wait to show the girls. It's not safe for you to be out in public right now. Daddy, I will be fine. Just hire me some bodyguards. Your score is going public in three, two... <gasps> what? You have 100%? Aw, and it looks like you both are only in the 90s. <sighs> Miss, we need to get you out of here. We have a code red. Who's that man behind you? Brooke, run... <sighs> Todd, how dare you? He was my favorite bodyguard. Are you Brooke Evans? Um, no. Take a... <gasps> uh, let me go, you jerks. Read this. <sighs> I am not reading that. Yes, you will. Hi, Daddy. This is Brookie. Unfortunately, I have been kidnapped, and... I'm sorry, can we cut? The lighting is just so bad. Just read the script. Okay, jeez. Hi, Daddy. They are saying that they want 1.2... I can't read that. Ugh. What? I don't have my contacts. All right, that's enough. Ow. Send us the money, or you're not going to see her again. You better not have ripped out my hair. Be quiet, or we're going to get the duct tape. I'm hungry. Can you guys get me some Starbucks or something? Who do you think we are, Uber Eats? Back to being a peasant. Okay, guys, they transferred the money. Now let me go. Change of plans. <laughs> we're bringing you to a new location. But that wasn't the deal. Someone else gave us a better offer for you. Hey, Brooke. Todd, you're... Shh, quiet. They're asleep. Huh? Hey, what do you think you're doing? Get back. You don't want to mess with me. I'm an ex-Navy SEAL. What's that supposed to mean, huh? It means he's going to kick your ass. I'd like to see him troll! Yes, Todd, get them! <coughs> and this is why Todd is my favorite bodyguard. Here she is, Mr. Evans. Honey, are you okay? Oh, it was awful. They wouldn't buy me Starbucks, and they made me record videos in horrible lighting. But we're rich again, so everything's fine. No, sweetheart. We realize you need some discipline. Yep. You should have listened to us. Ugh, you guys are annoying me. Talk like that again and you're going to boarding school. No, I'm sorry. You're going to treat us with respect. All right, I will. Hey, I just wanted to say I'm glad you're safe. Thanks, Todd. Happy birthday. We got you something. I think I know what it is. An iPhone 14 Colored pencils. pencils. Really? Hey, baby, Honey, they're magic pencils. Right. Class, write this down. Purple power unlocked. Hey babe, do you mind if we take a rain check on our date this week? Are you nervous? <laughs> what? No, of course not. Are you hiding something from me? Crap, I can't do this anymore. I cheated on you, okay? I'm sorry. I feel so bad you and your boyfriend broke up. This tells me people's emotions. You're not sad. I don't know what you're talking about. She was jealous of us. I knew it. Hey, um, where's mom? She's outside with Coco, giving her a lecture about listening. Coco, when mommy says stop, you say okay. I'm just a baby! Mom, you might not want to talk to her right now. But you still had to say okay, mom. I think you baby! I think today I'm going to go with red. Red power unlocked. I get to see people's ages. Well, this will be interesting. Hey, good morning, girly. You're 20? What? 
How did you find out? Never mind that, but why are you still in high school? I failed. I got held back. Hey, it's okay. Your secret is safe with me. Hey, I'm new. Is it cool if I sit here? Yeah, of course. Thanks. So, how old are you? Me? Oh, uh, I just turned 17 about, like, uh, two months ago. Psst, hey, what? Do you believe in vampires? No, why? Because I think I'm sitting next to one. Huh? You're funny. I'm telling you, he's a hundred years old. Can you watch my bag? I gotta use the restroom. Yeah, sure. See, he's- <gasps> Girl, what are you doing? Looking for evidence. Ew, what is that? I think this is- What the hell, dude? What are you doing with my stuff? What are you doing with my stuff? Well, I think the better question is, what are you doing with this? That's for my lunch. It's strawberry jam. Oh! <laughs> Can I have my stuff back? Yeah, sorry. Yesterday's power was kind of a disaster, so today I think I'm going to go with green. Green power unlocked. Let's hope this power helps me figure out if that guy is a vampire or not. Hey, so I just wanted to apologize about yesterday. You're good. I actually think you're kind of cute. <laughs> How old did you say you were again? Seventeen. I'm throwing a party tonight. Want to come? Yeah, sure. I would love that. Sweet. I'll airdrop you my address. Hey, you made it. Yeah, but where is everyone? They're on their way. Hey, Mom, this is the girl I was telling you about. Ooh, she looks beautifully delicious. Stop it. Really? I could just eat you. Oh, no. Try my punch, darling. The flavor is to die for. Get back. I'm leaving. Wait. I have two vampires after me. This calls for some extreme powers. What would happen if I just picked all of them? Are you sure you want to combine all the pencil's power? I have to. Wish mode activated. There you are. Please, don't be scared. I know you know I'm a vampire, and I'm sorry about lying about the party. Your mom was trying to... Kill me. I was just trying to hang out with you alone. I didn't realize she was going to act like that. She has bloodlust. I wish you were a vampire so you could understand. Wish granted. What just happened? I think you just turned me into a vampire. How is that even possible? Because I have a secret too, okay? I have magic colored pencils and I think you just used the last of their power. You don't have to worry about my mom killing you anymore. Thank you, because that makes me feel so much better. Hey, since I did this to you, I promise I'll protect you. I'll teach you how to be a great vampire. Mom, I can't do this anymore. I'm only 16. I, I can't handle her by myself. I have to put her up for adoption. Coming. Hi, my name is Emily. I was wondering if you wanted to buy some chocolate. Aren't you a little young to be selling stuff by yourself? Where's your mom? I, I ran away from my foster mommy. <sighs> you ran away? Oh, she's probably looking for you. Okay, here, um, come inside. Alright, well, I think I better call the police. What are you looking at? That little freckle you have right there. My daughter had the same one on her face. Oh my gosh, I think you might be my kid. You're my real mommy? You know what, I shouldn't have said that out loud. I don't know that for sure, but- Please, don't make me go back to my foster mom. She's really mean. Please don't bring me back to my foster mom. Sweetheart, I... Hi, I'm looking for a little girl. She has brown hair and brown eyes, and... Please, don't let her take me. Oh my gosh, Emily. <sighs> Sorry, she runs off a lot. Oh, does she? Well, she came to my house trying to sell me some chocolates. She... she makes me sell them. Oh boy, here we go again with the stories. I'm so sorry. But... but... Emily, do you want to time out? <gasps> No, no, please. Then tell her you're sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. All right, Emily, it's time to go. Tell her. Tell her that you're my real mommy. I... Emily, we're leaving. Come visit me. My address is 2122 Maplewood. No, wait. I found her house. You know, I think she is my daughter. And I think I want her back. I am so sorry to bother you. And this is going to sound kind of crazy, but... I think that Emily um, might be my daughter. And why do you think that? Well, about five years ago, I gave my daughter up for adoption. And how old is Emily? She's five. 
I see. And it's not just that. She also has a freckle in the same spot that my daughter had one. So you think that she's your daughter because of a freckle on <sighs> her face? Well, when you put it like that, it sounds... Look, I don't have time for this. No, please wait. I, I'm just asking for a DNA test. I don't have the funds for that. Oh, no. I would cover all of the expenses. And if she is your daughter, do you plan on taking her back? Well, yes, I do. And what if she isn't? Then I guess I would have to leave her with you then. <sighs> Fine. I'll allow it. She did great, and we should have the results in 48 hours. Hi, is this Miss Monroe? I'm calling from the doctor's office regarding your DNA test. Wow, that was fast, and yes it is. So, according to our test, it looks like Emily is not your biological <sighs> child. Are you... are you sure? Yes, ma'am. I'm so sorry. I hate to be the bearer of bad news. No, it's... it's okay. So what'd they say? Emily, I just want to tell you that I think that you're a great kid and I am so sorry for getting your hopes up. What do you mean? Oh, I knew it. You're not a biological mother, are you? Are you? No, I'm not. No, please don't leave me here. You are my mommy. I know it. I hope you're happy with yourself. Hello? Hi, is this Miss Monroe? We're calling regarding your DNA test. Yes, it is, but you guys have already called me. No, ma'am, I think you're mistaken. We just got your results in a few hours ago. What? And it does look like Emily is your biological child. Emily, it's me. Is anyone home? This is ridiculous. Where are they? That looked like Emily in the back seat. Where is she taking her? No, listen to me. You don't understand. I am telling you that she is in danger. Again, ma'am, you don't know that for sure. And we can't do anything until she's been missing for a total of 24 hours. You know, if they're not going to help me, I'm going to find her myself. Hi, excuse me. Um, have you seen a little girl that looks like this? No, I have not. I'm sorry. It's all right. It's the foster mom. But where's Emily? Hey. Oh, you scared me. Good. Now, where's my daughter? Good Lord. Didn't we just establish that she's not your daughter? She is my daughter, and I think you and I both know that. You had someone send a fake phone call to me, didn't you? <laughs> you can't prove anything. Where is she? She's with a new foster family now. What? You gave her to a new family? She was too much for me to handle. I had to transfer her. Where? No, no. That is confidential information. You better tell me right now or I'll- Don't you dare threaten me. You're the one who gave her up in the first place. So if you want to be mad at anyone, why didn't you go look in the mirror? Why would she fake that phone call if she wanted to get rid of Emily anyways? Wait. Well, she came to my house trying to sell me some chocolates. She- she makes me sell them. I don't think that she gave her up. I think she wants to keep her and use her to make money. Emily, that is enough. It's time for bed. I want my real mom. She's gone. No, let go. Open up, ma'am. This is the police. The child is not on the bottom floor. Hey. Shh, guys, I heard something. Hey. Emily! Emily! Get her turn 203. Ma'am, you cannot be in here. Please, I, I just want to know what's wrong with her. She's very dehydrated. Do you know how long she was in that closet for? No, I, I don't. This is all my fault. I should have cut to her sooner. Excuse me. Your daughter is awake now. You can come and see her. Mommy. Hi, sweetheart. <laughs> What's wrong? I thought you left me. <laughs> Emily, I promise you, I am never going to leave you again, okay? No, my foster mom's going to come back. Hey, hey, it's okay. Listen, your foster mom is not coming back. I'm going to take care of you from now on. <laughs> I promise. I promise. Now, you get some rest, okay, honey? Okay. Excuse me, Miss Monroe. There's a Daniel Knight here to see you. What? Mm-hmm. He's claiming to be the father of Emily. Daniel? Hey, how is she? How did you know we were here? Are you kidding? You and her are all over the news. How is she? Let me go see her. Whoa, whoa. Hang on a second. You took off the day that she was born because you didn't realize how difficult raising a kid would be. Look, I, I was 16, okay? So was I. And you left me alone with her. You know, if you didn't leave, I probably wouldn't have given her up in the first place. 
Oh, so you're saying this is all my fault? No, that's not what I'm saying. I just don't think right now is a good time for you to see her. She's been through enough shock. Please, Allie. No, you don't get to do that. You don't get to just walk back in here and start being her parent again. Isn't that what you did? <sighs> no, that was different. How? Face it, we're in the same boat here. We both made mistakes. You had a chance to fix yours. Now it's my turn. The doctor said she's going to be okay. She just needs to sleep. Wow, she's... She's beautiful. She definitely got her looks from you. Really, guys? You got me a paint set for my birthday? Sweetheart, that is a special paint set. This thing doesn't even come with a paintbrush. Press a color. Um, okay. <gasps> what is 13 times 379? 4,927. Excuse me? What the? I believe that's the answer. 4,927. That's right. Oh, what, what the hell? You didn't use a calculator. How did you... This power is making me super smart. Wanna ditch class and go to the mall? Yeah, but the probability of us getting caught is like 80%. I'll take my chances, Einstein. Let's go to the American Girl store. Okay. Aw, look at the cute girl and her doll. Hey, kid, did you know that American Girl dolls were invented in 1986? I think I know more about American Girl yeah. dolls than you do, You never kiss any American Girl set. Pick a color. Hmm. I think I'm gonna pick red today. Oh, I'm gonna fail this test. Hey, chill. Whoa. What? Are you by any chance wanting to become a doctor? How do you know that? Yeah, you know what? I just had this feeling, and uh, I would not sweat that test if I were you. You're gonna be just fine. I heard you could see the future. Sorry, I really don't know what you're talking about. Actually, give me your hand. What did you say your name was? Adrian. Why? Well, you could have this back. And just, um, stay away from me. Please tell me my future. Fine, but you're the last one I'm doing today. No holograms. No holograms. No! No, 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 no holograms. <laughs> what? What did you see? On Wednesdays, we wear pink. Sweetheart, Fluffy needs a bath. No way, that dog does not like me. Yes, she does. <laughs> see? You see? Hold her! No, no, no! Oh. Why did you never do this to me before? Hey, Darren, I think you left your phone in class. Aw, oh, jeez, thanks. I... I love you. What? Yeah, will you please be my girlfriend? Yes. I mean... Yes. I think this power makes anyone I touch fall in love with me. Sweetheart, I brought the team over for dinner. Please shake everyone's hand. Introduce yourself. Oh, no, I don't think that's a good idea. Too stuck up to shake our hands? No, it's not that. I just... Uh -huh. That's rude, bruh. You know what? Fine. Nice to meet you. Why are you guys looking at me like that? Want to see your boyfriend's feelings? 100%. Guess he's a keeper. Got this for you. Thanks. Of course, babe. Derek, is that you? Olivia. You two know each other? Yeah, we used to... Date. We were together for a little bit. We should all go out sometime. Yeah, we should. Boyfriend lost a little feelings. Hey, babe, do you maybe want to hang out tonight? Oh, sorry, babe. I already invited the boys over. They'll be here in a little bit. It's game night. More feelings lost. What is going on? You know what? Forget it. I don't care if it's boys' night. I have to go talk to him. Derek, I... <gasps> oh! Holy shit! Is she wearing my... Um, we we can explain. You should have knocked. Oh! Want to get revenge on your boyfriend? Pick your revenge for boyfriend. Revenge is ready. Take your revenge. Remember to use it wisely. Hey, can we talk? There is nothing to talk about. You and I are over. No, don't say that, okay? I just found out that Olivia is with another guy. Well, you know what they say. Karma is a real... Maria, please. What I did was stupid, and I promise it's not going to happen again. I want you, not her. Thanks for giving me a second chance. Of course. I'm not one to hold a grudge. You look so beautiful, babe. Thanks.
<laughs> Babe, I gotta tell you, this food is like really good. I'm glad you like it. I made it myself. What? I didn't know you could cook. You even got my favorite drink. Should we make a toast? To us. To us. Oh, babe, I hope you don't mind I switched our drinks. The one you gave me smelt a little strong. Whoa! You switched them? Yeah, I didn't think it was that big of a deal. <laughs> You've been coughing a lot. Are you okay? You know what? I'm gonna go get you some water. Your revenge has backfired. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. Would you like to receive the antidote? Is that even a question? Yes. Sorry I took so long, babe. Here you go. Thanks. What a hero. Boyfriend has lost a little feelings. That boy gains and loses feelings for me every five seconds. Olivia? What the hell are you doing here? It's Derek. He's in the hospital. Haven't you checked your phone? He got into a car accident. Derek? Bria, you came. Oh, I'm so glad I'll have you to take care of me. Actually, no, you won't. Because I'm breaking up with you. What? No! Please. It's like I said, Derek. Karma, it's a real bit. Want to see your boyfriend's feelings? 100%? Guess he's a keeper. Got this for you. Thanks. Of course, babe. Derek, is that you? Olivia. You two know each other? Yeah, we used to... Date. We were together for a little bit. We should all go out sometime. Yeah, we should. Boyfriend lost a little feelings. Hey, babe, do you maybe want to... Hang out tonight? Oh, sorry, babe. I already invited the boys over. They'll be here in a little bit. It's game night. More feelings lost. What is going on? You know what? Forget it. I don't care if it's boys' night. I have to go talk to him. Derek, I... <gasps> oh! Holy shit! Is she wearing my... Um, we, we can explain. You should have knocked. Oh! Want to get revenge on your boyfriend? Pick your revenge for boyfriend. Revenge is ready. Take your revenge. Remember to use it wisely. Hey, can we talk? There is nothing to talk about. You and I are over. No, don't say that, okay? I just found out that Olivia is with another guy. Well, you know what they say. Karma is a real... Maria, please. What I did was stupid, and I promise it's not going to happen again. I want you, not her. Thanks for giving me a second chance. Of course. I'm not one to hold a grudge. You look so beautiful, babe. Thanks. Babe, I gotta tell you, this food is, like, really good. I'm glad you like it. I made it myself. What? I didn't know you could cook. You even got my favorite drink. Should we make a toast? To us. To us. Oh, babe, I hope you don't mind I switched our drinks. The one you gave me smelt a little strong. Whoa! You switched them? Yeah, I didn't think it was that big of a deal. <laughs> You've been coughing a lot. Are you okay? You know what? I'm gonna go get you some water. Your revenge has backfired. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. Would you like to receive the antidote? Is that even a question? Yes. Sorry I took so long, babe. Here you go. Thanks. What a hero. Boyfriend has lost a little feelings. That boy gains and loses feelings for me every five seconds. Olivia? What the hell are you doing here? It's Derek. He's in the hospital. Haven't you checked your phone? He got into a car accident. Derek? Bria, you came. Oh, I'm so glad I'll have you to take care of me. Actually, no, you won't. Because I'm breaking up with you. What? No! Please. It's like I said, Derek. Karma. It's a real bit. Mom, I can't do this anymore. I'm only 16. I, I can't handle her by myself. I have to put her up for adoption. Coming. Hi, my name is Emily. I was wondering if you wanted to buy some chocolate. Aren't you a little young to be selling stuff by yourself? Where's your mom? I, I ran away from my foster mommy. <sighs> you ran away? Oh, she's probably looking for you. Okay, here, um, come inside. Alright, well, I think I better call the police. What are you looking at? That little freckle you have right there. My daughter had the same one on her face. Oh my gosh, 
I think you might be my kid. You're my real mommy? You know what? I shouldn't have said that out loud. I don't know that for sure, but please don't make me go back to my foster mom. She's really mean. Please don't bring me back to my foster mom. Sweetheart, I... Hi, I'm looking for a little girl. She has brown hair and brown eyes and... Please don't let her take me. Oh my gosh, Emily. I'm sorry, she runs off a lot. Oh, does she? Well, she came to my house trying to sell me some chocolates. She, she makes me sell them. Oh boy, here we go again with the stories. I'm so sorry. But, but, Emily, do you want to time out? <gasps> no, no, please. Then tell her you're sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. All right, Emily, it's time to go. Tell her, tell her that you're my real mommy. I... Emily, we're leaving. Come visit me. My address is 2122 Maplewood. No, wait. I found her house. You know, I think she is my daughter. And I think I want her back. I am so sorry to bother you. And this is going to sound kind of crazy, but I think that Emily um, might be my daughter. And why do you think that? Well, about five years ago, I gave my daughter up for adoption. And how old is Emily? She's five. I see. And it's not just that. She also has a freckle in the same spot that my daughter had one. So you think that she's your daughter because of a freckle on <sighs> her face? Well, when you put it like that, it sounds... Look, I don't have time for this. No, please wait. I, I'm just asking for a DNA test. I don't have the funds for that. Oh, no. I would cover all of the expenses. And if she is your daughter, do you plan on taking her back? Well, yes, I do. And what if she isn't? Then I guess I would have to leave her with you then. <sighs> Fine. I'll allow it. She did great, and we should have the results in 48 hours. Hi, is this Miss Monroe? I'm calling from the doctor's office regarding your DNA test. Wow, that was fast, and yes it is. So, according to our test, it looks like Emily is not your biological child. Are you... are you sure? Yes, ma'am. I'm so sorry. I hate to be the bearer of bad news. No, it's... it's okay. So what'd they say? Emily, I just want to tell you that I think that you're a great kid and I am so sorry for getting your hopes up. What do you mean? Oh, I knew it. You're not a biological mother, are you? Are you? No, I'm not. No, please don't leave me here. You are my mommy. I know it. I hope you're happy with yourself. Hello? Hi, is this Miss Monroe? We're calling regarding your DNA test. Yes, it is, but you guys have already called me. No, ma'am, I think you're mistaken. We just got your results in a few hours ago. What? And it does look like Emily is your biological child. Emily, it's me. Is anyone home? This is ridiculous. Where are they? That looked like Emily in the back seat. Where is she taking her? No, listen to me. You don't understand. I am telling you that she is in danger. Again, ma'am, you don't know that for sure. And we can't do anything until she's been missing for a total of 24 hours. You know, if they're not going to help me, I'm going to find her myself. Hi, excuse me. Um, have you seen a little girl that looks like this? No, I have not. I'm sorry. It's all right. It's the foster mom. But where's Emily? Hey. Ah, you scared me. Good. Now, where's my daughter? Good Lord. Didn't we just establish that she's not your daughter? She is my daughter, and I think you and I both know that. You had someone send a fake phone call to me, didn't you? <laughs> you can't prove anything. Where is she? She's with a new foster family now. What? You gave her to a new family? She was too much for me to handle. I had to transfer her. Where? No, no. That is confidential information. You better tell me right now or I'll- Don't you dare threaten me. You're the one who gave her up in the first place. So if you want to be mad at anyone, why didn't you go look in the mirror? Why would she fake that phone call if she wanted to get rid of Emily anyways? Wait. Well, she came to my house trying to sell me some chocolates. She- she makes me sell them. I don't think that she gave her up. I think she wants to keep her and use her to make money. Emily, that is enough. It's time for bed. I want my real mom. She's gone. No, let go. Open up, ma'am. This is the police. The child is not on the bottom floor. No. Shh, guys, I heard something. No. 
Emily. Emily? Get her to room 203. Ma'am, you cannot be in here. Please, I, I just want to know what's wrong with her. She's very dehydrated. Do you know how long she was in that closet for? No, I, I don't. This is all my fault. I should have cut to her sooner. Excuse me. Your daughter is awake now. You can come and see her. Mommy. Hi, sweetheart. <laughs> What's wrong? I thought you left me. <laughs> Emily, I promise you, I am never going to leave you again, okay? No, my foster mom's going to come back. Hey, hey, it's okay. Listen, your foster mom is not coming back. I'm going to take care of you from now on. <laughs> Promise. I promise. Now, you get some rest, okay, honey? Okay. Excuse me, Miss Monroe. There's a Daniel Knight here to see you. What? Mm-hmm. He's claiming to be the father of Emily. Daniel? Hey, how is she? How did you know we were here? Are you kidding? You and her are all over the news. How is she? Let me go see her. Whoa, whoa. Hang on a second. You took off the day that she was born because you didn't realize how difficult raising a kid would be. Look, I, I was 16, okay? So was I. And you left me alone with her. You know, if you didn't leave, I probably wouldn't have given her up in the first place. Oh, so you're saying this is all my fault? No, that's not what I'm saying. I just don't think right now is a good time for you to see her. She's been through enough shock. Please, Allie. No, you don't get to do that. You don't get to just walk back in here and start being her parent again. Isn't that what you did? <sighs> No, that was different. How? Face it, we're in the same boat here. We both made mistakes. You had a chance to fix yours. Now it's my turn. The doctor said she's going to be okay. She just needs to sleep. Wow, she's... She's beautiful. She definitely got her looks from you. Come on, give me an X. Oh, no, no, no. I cannot be a hider. My whole family are seekers. Concealer, please don't fail me now. Okay, let's see your mark. <gasps> yes, I knew Our it. Our girl is a seeker. Now we can finally tell you how the game works. So, of course, there's hiders and there's seekers, but everyone wants to be a seeker. The hiders are given a certain amount of time to hide, and then we get to go find them. When you find the hiders, do you... No, honey. <sighs> okay. We knock them out, and then we trade them in for money. What? If you turn in a family member that's a hider, you get a million. Well, I mean, that's kind of stupid because family members, they are worth a lot more than money, right? I'd turn your butt in in five seconds. <laughs> <laughs> Honey. What? You're sweating. No. You okay? Um, no, I actually think that I might be bleeding, so I'm going to go wash my face. I'll be right back. Oh, shit. I knew it. The makeup came off. What the? Ellie. No. You're a hider. I can explain. You little liar. I'm telling mom and dad. Kim's a hider. What? What? She faked her mark. I'm sorry. Why would you do that? Because I, I was scared. Attention. The game has begun. All hiders now have two hours to find a hiding spot. Go hide. No. You have to. Just don't let us find you. But hide now, damn it. Get out of here. This is my spot. I don't know where to hide. All the flights are booked and all the buses are filled. What am I gonna do? <coughs> Shh! Listen, you're about to get caught. Hey, I said you're about to get caught. Come on, let's go. You're a seeker. You're trying to trick me. This mark is fake. If I were a real seeker, you'd be knocked out by now. Just play along. What? Shh, don't say anything. Well, well, what do we have here? You caught a hider, huh? Yeah, she was a hard one to find, but I finally caught her. We were just leaving, actually. Nah, she's not going anywhere. Don't touch her! Um, are hiders allowed to fight back? No, not really. Run! Oh, shit. Quick, in there! Whoa, wait, what is that? An underground tunnel I made. Now, come on! I am not going down there. I don't even know if I can really trust you. I've gotten you this far, haven't I? We have to go now. We'll be safe down here. Why are you helping me? Because you... Who gave you that necklace? My sister. Get rid of that necklace. Your sister is tracking you. No, she... she wouldn't. Oh, yes, she would. We need to keep moving. No. Excuse me? Yeah, I want to know why you came out of nowhere like, like some ninja and saved me, but you don't even know me. 
It's because you remind me of my sister who got traded in by my family. They traded in your sister for a million dollars? Yeah, and from then on, I've been trying to protect all the hiders I can. What was that? They found my tunnel. I'll distract them, you run. No, I'm not gonna leave you. Yes, you are. I'm not losing another girl on my watch. Now go! <laughs> Ellie, found you. You're it. Oh. Sorry, sis. That necklace led me right to you. Time to get my million. Nighty night, Kim. Time to get my money. Where am I? And what am I wearing? We're in Hyder Prison, and that's our uniform. They think we're related. Really? I mean, we do kind of look alike, I guess. You remind me of my sister, who got traded in by my family. Do you have a brother that's a hider? Yeah, why? Because I think I know him. He tried to save me, but my sister turned me in. He is so worried about you. There has to be some way out of here. After you get caught, you have the option to end the game, but if you do, you die. Someone has to sacrifice themselves to save everyone else. That's why no one ends the game. I'll do it. My whole family turned against me, so I really have nothing, and you deserve to be with your brother. No. Want to end the game? It'll be okay. No, please. Congratulations, your bravery has made you leader. Our marks are gone. You pick the next game. Wanna play mother, may I, for a chance to win 50 million? I always wanted a mother, and I can use the money to buy myself my own house one day. Hello. Hi. Are you really my mother now? Yes, I am your mother. You listen to me. Okay. Mother, may I have this cookie? No, you may not. But- Do not argue with me. It is past your bedtime. Mother, may you sing me a bedtime song? I'm tired, but I can't sleep. No. <laughs> Hush, little baby. Don't say a word. Mother's going to buy you a mockingbird. Thank you, Mother. You're the best mother I ever had. Hey, Mother, I was just thinking, may I know what happens if I don't listen to you? No, you may not. Well, Mother, may I go to school? Yes, you may. Hey! Sorry. You made me spill my iced coffee. Mother, may I hit her again? No. You didn't ask me permission the first time. Hey! Sorry. You made me spill my iced coffee. Mother, may I hit her again? No. You didn't ask me permission the first time. Mother, may I go see a friend? Yes, you may. Hey, what's wrong? Remember the bully I had since elementary school? Yeah. She was eliminated from the game today. And I'm pretty sure that Mother wants me to win this game. You think Mother wants you to win the 50 million? Yes. Look, I get you are a foster kid and Mother is the closest thing you've had to a real mom. But she's AI. She doesn't have feelings. No, listen to me. I am telling you, I am pretty sure that I am her favorite. Okay, let's test this then. Mother, may I go to Sarah's party? No, no. Mother, may I go to Sarah's party? Yes, you may. What? Forget mother, I'm going. Jocelyn, wait, don't go. She's not gonna do anything. Mess around and find out. I have to shut down mother. I have to shut down mother. Mother, may I please have some water? No. You haven't let me drink water for three days. Mother, may I please give her some of my water? No. You may not. I can't take this anymore. Give me the water. Please, if you just hold on a little bit longer, I'm gonna- Save you. Mother, may I ask you a question? Yes. How many players are left in this game? There are three players left. Mother, may I go to sleep? Of course. But wait, I'm always watching. Do you understand? Yes, I understand. Good night. It's time for me to end this game once and for all. Stop. You didn't ask me permission to come here. I'm sorry, Mother. I can't let this game go on anymore. Don't. If you unplug that, I will have you eliminated. No, you won't, because I know you care about me. If you were going to kill me, you would have done it already. I have to do this. Wait. I can show you your real mother. I'm sorry, I have to shut you off. Wait, I can show you your real mother. You can? Yes, she's closer than you think. Your real mother is- Shut her off! 
Mother powering down. Finally, the game's over. Jocelyn? Forget mother, I'm going. Jocelyn, wait, don't go. She's not gonna do anything. Surprise, I survived. I'm glad you're okay, but she was right about to tell me who my real mother was. I'm sorry, but she had to be shut down. Do you feel like this was a little too easy? Wouldn't you think there would be security? Yeah, that is odd. Forget about it. All that matters is that this crazy game is over. Hey, I'm going home. Be safe, okay? Hello, it's you. You're beautiful. Why do you sound so... Familiar? It's me, Mother. Don't be scared, sweetheart. I'm just the voice of Mother. But I'm also... Your real mother. No. All that matters is that this crazy game is over. Hey, I'm going home. Be safe, okay? Hello, it's you. You're beautiful. Why do you sound so... Familiar? It's me, Mother. Don't be scared, sweetheart. I'm just the voice of Mother. But I'm also... Your real mother. No. I'm so sorry. I had to put you up for adoption so I could run this game. But now it's over. You hurt so many people. I never meant for this game to get so brutal. I started out by doing this as a science experiment. But it made me lose sight of the things that really matter. Even as mother, I was watching over you. I wanted you to win that 50 million. But don't worry. Because I'm going to make a new game. What? Yes, and I was thinking, instead of Mother May I, we could all play Red Light Green Light. And since you're my daughter, you'll have to play. Grandma, what is that above my head? Those are all your childhood memories, dear, and it looks like you've already made quite a lot of them. Well, that's good, because I want to remember all the fun things I did with you. Oh, Annalise, you are so sweet. <laughs> there is a fire in the castle. We need to get you both out now. Grandma, I'm scared. I don't want to lose you like I lost my parents. Don't worry, dear. We'll be alright. My queen, watch out! The ceiling is collapsing! No! You left your clothes on the floor. Sorry, I just... They pay me to foster you, not to be your maid. Didn't anyone ever teach you to clean up after yourself? Well, you know, even if someone did, I really wouldn't have remembered because I lost all my childhood memories. Yeah, yeah, enough with your sob story. Just clean up. Excuse me, sir. Do you know why there's a bunch of flowers everywhere? Oh, yeah, those are for the princess. Everyone leaves those for her. Today marks the fifth year of her passing. It's awful what happened to her. Hey, are you okay? I think I just had a memory of me being a princess. Sorry, I know that sounds crazy. A princess? Wait, did something happen to your memories? Yeah, actually, when I was younger, some sort of accident happened to me. I don't remember what, but the doctor told me that I have amnesia. Some people still think the princess is still alive. They do? Yeah, and actually, I'm one of those people. You know, I could take you to the Queen if you really think you're the princess. No, that's okay. Uh, I really should be going. At least take my number. If any more of your memories come back, call me. I can't believe that guy thought that I was a princess. My Queen, watch, watch out! The ceiling is collapsing! No! no, no. Grandma? She left me. Uh, my head... Hey, I got your voicemail. You got another memory? I think that I am the princess, and I need your help to take me back to the queen. I think that I am the princess, and I need your help to take me back to the queen. The thing is, they won't just let anyone into the castle. We have to convince them that you're royalty. But how would I do that? I have an idea. Come on, we're going shopping. Are you sure this outfit isn't too much? No, I think it's perfect. It shows the queen that you know how to dress like a princess. If you say so... Wait here. The Queen will see you in just a moment. Hey, it's gonna be alright. She'll remember you. Grandma, I thought I'd never- See me again. I've heard it all before. Tell me something that only my Annalise would know. Well, I can't exactly do that because a lot of my memories got lost, but I remember you. Stop. My heart can't take this anymore. She's just another girl pretending to be my granddaughter. Take her away. No, please. I came all this way to see you. I'm sure I can remember something. Let's go. A carousel music box. It was blue. You gave it to me. Wait. A carousel music box. It was blue. You gave it to me. Wait. Let her go. I need to get something to show her. This was one of the few things that survived the fire. I had it restored. I bought it as a gift for my granddaughter. You couldn't have known about that unless... It's me, Grandma. Oh, Annalise, it is you. I recognize your eyes. I'm so sorry. I begged the gods to go look for you. It's okay. How are you alive? What happened? 
I can barely remember. Sweetheart, can you remember anything about what happened to you? What your name is? What your parents' names are? I don't remember anything. We have a code red. So you survived the fire and woke up in a hospital with amnesia? I am so sorry, but what's important is we're together now. Grandma, I actually wouldn't have been able to find you if it wasn't for him. Oh, really? What is your name? My name is Eric, Your Majesty. I can't thank you enough, Eric. Why aren't you a handsome young man? Ah, uh, thanks. It is my honor to restore my granddaughter's title of Princess Annalise. Long live the princess. Happy birthday! Hope you like your gift! Gummy bears? Really, guys? They're magic! Each one gives you a different ability. Okay, let's see what the red one does. Hey, check it out! Someone left five bucks on the street. Wait, don't go over there. That car came out of nowhere! How did you know that was gonna happen? I, I don't know, I just did. Excuse me, Bria. Could I see you after class? You wanted to see me, Mr. Peters? Yes, I have an assignment for you. And it's not on paper, if you know what I mean. Actually, I have to go. Mom, I think we need to report my... What is he doing? Your little brother is building a tower. With bricks? No, wait, I think he's gonna... Oh no! Our table! It's broken! What color should I choose today? Hmm, just kidding. I already picked it. Let's go with blue. Hey, can I go to Jessica's party this weekend? No. Jessica is a bad influence on you. Mom, she's fine. Actually, she's fine. Okay, so can I go? No, I, I just said no. Oh, come on, just let me go. Okay, sure, honey, you can go. I think I know what my ability is now. See ya. Hi, I'd like to return the shirt I bought here. Sure, do you have the receipt? I don't, I actually lost it. Oh, yeah, no receipt, no refund. Oh, but it still has the tags on it, and I have the card that I used to pay for it. Yeah, don't care. I need the receipt, okay? Your new return policy is no receipt, no problem. So let's get that refund started, shall we? Your brother wants to play. Would you just forget about me? I have work to do. Hey, Tommy, I just wanted to say I'm sorry. I shouldn't have yelled at you. Wait a minute! What? Who are you? <gasps> Yesterday's ability was really weird, so let's go with purple today. Please don't be bad. Hey, Dad, I'm gonna head to Jessica's party. Now, wait just a minute. Don't worry, Mom said I can go. I better let her have some fun before I break with the news about the divorce. Uh, you and Mom are getting a divorce? I didn't... Oh, no, you got mine reading today, didn't you? Sweetheart, you weren't supposed to find out like that. Good morning, Bria. Good morning, Mr. Peters. She's got such pretty eyes and a really cute butt. What a creep. Ew, there she is. I don't want to talk to her. Hi, bestie! Oh, don't bestie me. You are a fake friend. You know what? Take your friendship bracelet back. Ow! I'm so sorry. I did not mean to hit you in your face. Come here! <gasps> I can't believe she broke my freaking elbow. What are you looking at, Daryl? I don't care that you broke your elbow. Ah! <sighs> Well, now that my elbow's finally healed, I'm going with green today. Well, what is that? Wait, can I control time? Oh, this is gonna be fun. Why are you packing a suitcase? I'm moving out, honey, remember? Yeah, the divorce. You know, this whole thing isn't right. I know you still care about mom. You just need to show her a little more. Now, before I unpause him, I'm gonna give him this to hold for mom. Perfect. Daniel, who prepared this dinner? Dad did. I did? I, I mean, uh, yeah. Oh, baby, this is really romantic. Okay, I don't need to see this. You ready for the talent show? Wait, that was today? Don't tell me you forgot. Of course not. <laughs> Taught myself how to play this in one hour, so let's hope it goes well. She's really good. Anything I touch turns to money, or any doll I touch comes to life. I'm too little to have money, and I don't have any friends in foster care, so I pick this one. I pick this Barbie to come to life. Whoa. Hi, I'm Come Alive Barbie. Are you gonna be my friend? 
Of course, I can be anything you want me to be. You can brush my hair and take me anywhere. Cool. You can also customize me using this remote. I want to give you brown eyes like me. Oh, Claire, who are you talking to? Uh-oh, who's that? That's another foster girl that lives here, and she's really mean to dolls. We have to hide you. Come on. Claire, who are you talking to? Nobody. Hi, I'm Come Alive Barbie. What the? Barbie, I told you to hide. Sorry, Claire. I just love making new friends. Does this control her? Hey, give that back. Ugh, just let me see it. Stop, you're gonna break her. Ugh, you're so annoying. This is why no one wants to adopt you. I don't want your dumb remote anyways. You killed her. <laughs> Have fun with your dead Barbie. Barbie, please wake up. Hola. Soy Barbie. ¿Cómo estás? Uh-oh, I think she reset you onto Spanish mode. Eres mi mejor amiga. Barbie, I can't understand you. What am I gonna do? Barbie, I can use my powers to bring Ken to life to help us. I hope you know how to bring Barbie off of Spanish mode. Hey, Barbie. Hola, Ken. Why is she speaking Spanish? That's why I brought you here, Ken. I don't know how to make her speak English. Can I see her remote? Sure. That should do it. Hey, Barbie. Hi, Ken. Want to go for a drive? Sure, Ken. Activate the Barbie car. We cannot tell anyone that you're dolls. What do we say if they ask us? Tell them that, that you're my parents. Okay. Shh, we have to be really quiet so we can sneak out of here. Thanks for buying me this stuff, Barbie. Claire, you deserve it. Hey, you. You never paid me back my money. Claire. Claire! How dare you? Who are you guys? We are her parents. She got adopted? That's right, and one of her mother's many jobs is being a police officer. So if you don't leave right now, we're going to have you arrested. No, no, sorry, forget about the money. Bye! Claire! Are you okay? My arm got a little cut. Press the top button on the remote. Okay. Dr. Barbie is here to help. You're so strong, Claire. You should be feeling much better now. Barbie, Ken, you said that you can be anything, right? Yeah. That's right. Well, I want you to be my real mommy and daddy. You want us to adopt you? Yeah. Can you do that? Barbie, Ken, you said that you can be anything, right? Yeah. That's right. Well, I want you to be my real mommy and daddy. You want us to adopt you? Yeah. Can you do that? Claire, we... I understand if you don't want to because I know I'm not that great. What? Why would you think that? Because I'm not as smart or as cute as the other kids. I think that's why nobody wants to adopt me. Oh, Claire. Don't think like that. You're so smart. And you're super cute. Do you really think so? Claire, you can do anything you put your mind to. And anyone who tells you otherwise doesn't know what they're talking about. We would be honored to be your parents because you're such a good girl. Right, Ken? That's right, Barbie. Really? Yeah. Being a dad sounds fun. Guys, I forgot I had this in my pocket. My puppy. Since we're a family now, do we want to have a pet? Absolutely. Aww. Aww. This is going to be so much fun. I'll start looking for Barbie houses for us to live in. I'm so happy for us. We're going to be a great family. Yeah. Barbie and Ken, finally together at last. Ugh. Ow, my head. Barbie, Ken, what's wrong? Ugh, my head. Barbie, Ken, what's wrong? I... I don't know. All of a sudden, we just feel really strange. My powers, they're running out. Oh no. All of you are gonna turn back into dolls. How much time do we have left? One minute. Please don't leave me. Claire, we'll never leave you. We might not be able to be your parents, but we'll always be your dolls. Yes, and you're going to get adopted. Do you promise? We promise. I'm gonna miss you so much. We'll still be together. You can take us wherever you go. Barbie, our eyes. They're melting. You guys are crying. Oh, the time's up. You guys are gonna... We love you. See you on the other side. If it isn't the little tattletale, where are your parents now, huh? They're right... They're at home. So you better not try anything or I'm gonna tell on you. No, no, I was just wondering. <laughs> I was looking for you all day. I'm sorry, I was just... I didn't want to hear it. You're lucky someone wants to adopt you. What? I'm getting adopted? Yes, finally. You guys were right. What? Who was right? Nothing. 
Meet your new parents. Hi. Hey. Can I bring my dolls? Oh, honey, of course. We'll consider them a part of our family.